Vertical supranuclear gaze palsy is often a prominent feature of disease, although this is usually subtle at onset and may require careful examination to detect. Here, a patient with Neiman-Pick disease type C is contrasted against an individual with normal eye movements. Disordered vertical gaze typically begins with a lag or latency initiating saccadic eye movements. These are the rapid conjugate movements of the eyes that allow us to shift fixation between distantly spaced objects. Progressive slowing of these movements ensues and eventually total gaze paresis occurs. Whilst overt gaze palsy is readily evident upon examination of extraocular movements, Saccades are best examined by asking the patient to rapidly alternate fixation between two vertically positioned objects. The examiner should take note of the time to initiation, speed, accuracy and conjugacy of the saccadic movements. The neural coordination of eyelid movement, blinks and vertical gaze is complex. However, concomitant blinking is known to increase the velocity of abnormally slowed saccades in a number of neurodegenerative conditions. And this phenomenon is often utilized by patients with Neiman-Pick disease type C, resulting in prominent blinking when shifting their gaze in the vertical plane. Patients will also accommodate their oculomotor paresis by moving their head to achieve fixation. This can be one of the first features recognized by friends and family. Abnormalities of horizontal saccades may also be seen although typically they occur later in the disease course.